Hello everyone, it's Chuck Thunder, and we're here with another episode of our potential Let's Play. It's been a while, I'm here to check in with you guys to see what I've been up to for the while now. So, I've been custom shipbuilding um, for a good while now. I'm just kind of um, trying to get my uh, feet wet with getting myself up in my shipbuilding skill with this tune. And I have managed to get to level rank 2 with it so far. I have two more days I gotta do with the ship. So, you know, just wanted to check in with you guys and see what I've been up to. Uh, I've been on a little bit of a hiatus for a while. Um, that hiatus being that I got married. Uh, the last couple of weeks have been pretty busy. Did my honeymoon, did the wedding. So, been very busy. So, I appreciate those of you who have subscribed, even though I have not been around for about two, three weeks. I do appreciate those loyal to sticking around with me. It's been awesome that you guys have made it through and are wanting to see what else I do with this channel in the meantime. So, you haven't missed much. I promise that. Oh, I can't hold any more items because I have to discard something. What? Never had this issue with all oh, this because I'm with this tune that I don't typically use this for. Man. Oh, but I could store something here. So, let's go ahead and store. Jeez. So many do oh, I can't even get any more tow permits even if I wanted to. Well, we're going to be using something, but let's go ahead and store this. And we are going to... Can't even get more tow requests anyway, so we'll hold on to those. Um, so I just got to sit out at sea for a, a little while longer. Um, not much longer, so we'll just set that to sail and check on the other tune. So this tune has been busy, and so have I. This tune is doing um, shipbuilding, and this tune has taken on one of the ships that I shipbuilt. I uh, took a clipper, just for the sake of saying I've always wanted a clipper. Um, and this tune is going to hand in some quests, or not quests, um, um, hand in uh, some discoveries. So I have somehow made some discoveries, besides a religious relic one, geography that I have not reported. So I'm going to go report them while we have this uh, boost going on. We have a bit of a boost uh, right now, and I'm hoping I get some level of boost from this. Do I, need to, I don't have anything that will help me boost even further. So I just need to talk to um, Duke Barganza at the palace here in Lisbon. While I'm here, I might as well invest two in the city. I just like to do that. Which I need to do that more often with my other tune in order to get some of the benefits of. Let's see. I can't invest because it's not my territory. Duh. Alright, so let's report. Geography. And let's go ahead and report these. Get the QMPs. Yeah, I'm getting a 100% bonus of fame. Oh, I should be in an adventure job. So much work to switch. So much money to switch. Ah, man. This sucks. I don't want to spend one point something million. I guess I should. Alright, so let's just pay attention to this guy. So, I went and handed in one discovery. and got 26 adventure fame. And I am not in an adventure job. So, remember that. 26 adventure fame by handing in that... Let's see what I would have gotten if I was in the correct job. So let's go to the uh, Adventurers Guild here. Let's of course, shortcut this a bit by going to the port and then going to the Adventurers Guild. And let's switch to an adventure job. Man, I hate having to do this. I mean, I don't plan on going to Southeast Asia anytime soon. I mean, I kind of am, but not too, too soon with this tune. This just takes so long. So let's change our job. Uh, Helms person is usually what I go with. Adventure learner is always a good start. But freaking cats are attacking each other. But let's go ahead and do this. I can't even wear the outfit I want to wear anymore because I'm not in that job. We're going to switch back. After I hand in my jobs here. Alright, back to the Royal State. So while he walks over there, this should be done. 
We are going to go back to collect the ship I made by going to the shipyard. And I'm also going to go invest with this guy too while I have the money on me. Collect my ship. Got my clipper. I'm going to go ahead and sell. Oh, not buy. Sell that clipper. So we're going to do another custom ship build. And we are going to another build another clipper. I don't know if this is the most effective thing. I've read all sorts of things. Oh, the fastest is to do the Barker because you'll be coming and going. But if you're someone like me who doesn't like to keep them coming in and out, in and out every two minutes, you pick one of these higher level requ requisite build uh, things and you get more than 28 um, building days like that and you'll get... Um, uh, you'll get, you know, more um, skill that way. So I do the trading clipper because it's 25 days. Uh, or the regular clipper, I should say, because it's a little bit cheaper. Not that it matters much. Say so yes. Always build it to be the fastest in case somebody... In case somebody's like, hey, does anyone have a spare clipper? Not that it matters. I always name them sell. And then we'll do that. But what we will do is we will go to the Royal Class Hole to invest. And this guy should be here already. Go walk down. So yeah guys, I'm sorry that I've been gone for so long. I really do appreciate swinging by. So I'm reporting to the correct guy here. What do I get now? Double the adventure fame. Almost double. So it's worth it if you want that fame uh, to be boosted. You don't get like any amount of experience or anything, but definitely get more fame and reporting to the right people gets you that. I don't even know that this is the right place. Where do I report religious relics to? Because honestly, I don't know if I'm going to bother going someplace to report the religious relics somewhere else. If I was doing religious relics, where would I go? England or Netherlands? Oh, Santa Cruz Marquis? Alright, that's not a bad deal. We're not going very far. So we'll go to that. Take him back to Seville. Oh, no, we can go to Zinga Memba in Lisbon, actually, and get the same idea. So let's do that. Where's Memba? There he is, right here. He's somebody who could report to religious relics, too. So we'll just go there. Much closer than having to go to Seville right now. Port. Done. Get back QMP. And I got some extra social ability skill. What has he got for me? He's got any skills that I want? No. I also want Swahili. Alright, so let's go back and switch back to a trading job. Because that's, that's our main goal with this guy. Alright, so while he does that, we are going to go invest... Do I have any discoveries here? One port settlement. That's it. That's it. All right. Well, not worth switching for right now. Sweet. And let's go back out to sea. And wait 25 minutes with Chuck Thunder. So, this is pretty much what I've been doing nonstop. You can also turn these trips into some value if you really want. Like, go sail someplace. It takes 25 minutes to sail to and come back. You can absolutely do that. Um, and I don't really have any plans right now. Like, I can't change my ship in anything right now. I can't use it. 
I'm just literally using this ship right now because it's the only ship that I have. And um, this one is one I'm working towards, but I need to get to Adventure Level 24, and I'm not there yet. Which, I don't know why I would need it other than for traveling someplace faster. And I use this one for storage. I could probably make myself a better storage ship if I wanted. But we are just going to set sail and wait in port. Because that's what we do around here. Probably should go to college with this tune and go get the added proficiency bonuses that I can get with him. Um, and now we go to the Merchant Guild with him and switch back over. So this is why I don't like to play two tunes at once because it's like, do one thing with him, do another thing with him, sit around. But because I'm doing shipbuilding with one, I'm not too concerned. So yeah, it's cost me 1.6 million to switch back to spice trading. Which is not one that I don't mind doing because it gets me cooking skill, which is something I, you know, favorite skill, which is something I like. I could boost my cooking skill that way. Um, I could do foods dealer and animal trader so I can get more livestock and more food trading. But then so does this. You know, if I want to go back to that. I just go with this one because it costs more to change in and out of. Well, maybe I should just stick with this until I know I need to go spice trading. That way if I need to switch back and forth, it doesn't hurt as much. See, that's smarter, Victor. That's much smarter. But I'm, I need to level my spice trading, though. Mm. Don't know what to do. I don't plan on doing much of this tune right now, so we're just going to switch. It's kind of inconsequential to switch to this, which means that we could switch back to these items. Couldn't wear this if I was in the trade-type job. Okay, I see. And this has to be a trade-type job, yeah. I see. All right. And we'll go ahead and put that staff back on. And we're all dressed back up. Dressed to the T. Maybe what we'll do with this tune, because what I want to do is I want to get him... I don't know if I'm going to modify this ship. Um, I just kind of want him to sail around with it, because I like it. So I probably will do some quick sails here to go... Um, make some more food. Okay. And you have two minutes in. So, this is what you're missing, guys. Me sitting in dock, doing these, getting my um, shipbuilding skill up. That's pretty much all I'm going to do. I'm going to play around a bit with custom shipbuilding um, a little bit more as I play more, um, as I rank up. Right now, I'm just kind of focusing on getting it up as much as I possibly can while I have this boost going on. So, not much to see here at the moment. Um, I do want to try to do some ship mining, but there's no point in doing any ship mining until you reach a point where you can do ship mining and get good results. So it's not really much of a, an issue for me right now. I'm kind of just grinding away. Like I said, I might take Check Thunder to go get some school done. Because a lot of the school stuff is pretty easy to do. Um, and I can get some bonuses for that. Um, I still have a lot of skill slots available and I just don't know what to, tr what to do with them yet. So all stuff I'm going to think about um, with this tune as I play. I might, since I'm doing weapons trading, and you know, since I've been doing casting, and I've been kind of leveling the casting skill with him, I'm already at rank 10, which is pretty damn sweet. I might, um, I don't even middle training. I might do, um, handicrafts. Might be something I do. That, um, or sewing if I want to do sales. Handicrafts might be a good idea. I learned in the beginnings of this. Venice or Calais? Yeah. So we might do that. We might do some of that sailing around to get some of that in the meantime. You guys don't need to see me do that. I'm going to work my way up this uh, handicrafts uh, tree here. Um, I just need to get to art trading level 2, which is found in Venice too, so that's easy. And handicrafts is probably found in Naples, which ain't far. So yeah, we'll be good. Might as well do jewelry trading while we're at it. Oh, I'm not going to go to Safala. So, you got the idea, guys. That's all I'm going to be doing in the meantime. Not missing anything. Just literally making food. Um, that is going to be my goal with this tune. 
just grinding food, get his skill up, which actually, now that I'm thinking about it, his cooking skill is probably already, like, yeah, it's already pretty much high. Um, I'd like to get it to rank 14 without the use of um, items. That would be ideal. I'll get my management skill up to level 9, too, or level 10 would be good. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. Nothing else here going on, guys. You're not missing much. I do appreciate sticking through. We, cr we crossed 200 subscribers this past month, which is freaking sweet. Only 800 more to go, everyone. Tell your friends. Hide your kids. Or actually, don't hide your kids and don't hide your wife. Tell your kids. Tell your wife. Sign me up. Tell them you like me. Uh, I'm not that great, but great enough to get 200 subscribers, apparently. So, I appreciate it, everybody, for swinging by, checking in with me. It's been great. It's your boy, Chuck Thunder. And uh, thanks for watching.